Hey, today we're going to install a uh, Micro Air Easy Start for this uh, train air conditioner. I'm going to pull out my phone here and uh, trigger the air conditioner to come on. And uh, we'll see what, uh, what the inrush is on this uh, unit uh, without the, the Easy Start. <laughs> The inrush reported at 93.9 amps. That's a lot. <laughs> uh, let's see. Um, let's reset and let's see what our running amps are. So we're currently running about uh, 6.1 amps. So let's see what uh, what the micro air easy start can do for us. Okay, we've got the micro air easy start all installed and ready to go. Uh, got the, the connections. The simple, essentially, in a nutshell, um, if you're not uh, familiar with you know electrical components of uh, HVAC equipment. You know, don't attempt this yourself. Um, but uh, essentially the orange wire from the micro air goes to the Herm terminal on the um, capacitor. And then the brown wire connects to the red wire that was once going to the contactor. The white wire then from the micro air goes to the contactor right there. And then the black wire from the micro air Easy start goes uh, and connects to the black side of the um, contactor. So that's uh, pretty much it. Let's see, this is gonna be the very first time. <clears throat> so we'll see what uh, amperage drop we have um, just uh, from the first time. And then this has to learn uh, over four periods uh, and we'll see how it improves as it learns how this uh, starts up. So. Let me uh, turn the uh, air conditioner on, and uh, we'll see we'll see how it goes. And well, that's already a significant uh, reduction. 22.2 amps down from 93 so that uh, that was pretty awesome we'll see how uh, <clears throat> it goes after cycling a few times the other thing I want to check is it's um, running amperage Uh, looks like as far as running goes we're about the same it's also a little warmer uh, than it was earlier today before I wired it up so that uh, could be it but it uh, certainly decreased the uh, starting amperage by a long shot okay this is the second startup Third time learning. Here we go. Getting lower. 21.7. and final time. Here we go. Lowest time yet. 19.6. Like 
all right, guys, I hope you found this video helpful. Um, I'm going to leave some links down in the description uh, so you can find uh, more information on the Micro Air Easy Start. Find out where to purchase uh, your own. Their website is full of very helpful information, so be sure and check that out. This unit is going to help me in three ways. Uh, way number one, it's going to allow me to run my full-size air conditioner on a portable generator, actually. You saw just how much of a difference. We started out at about 93 amps, and uh, there on the fourth cycle, we were down to about 19 so huge, huge difference uh, in terms of, um, you know, that starting amperage. And then that leads me to the second reason. I think it's going to help preserve the life of my compressor substantially. Think about that much amperage running into the compressor every time it starts. Um, that's a lot of uh, heat that's generated with that much amperage, as well as just, you know, the mechanical stress of um, you know, hitting it with that, uh, that much amperage and twisting it that hard. Um, I think, uh, with the slow, you know, easy, uh, ramp up that the, uh, micro air easy start does, it's going to make a huge difference in the longevity of my air conditioner. And then number three, um, just general, um, electricity savings, you know, um, the power isn't always out here, uh, thank goodness. And, so the air conditioner is going to be running, you know, the majority of the time on uh, the main power, but, uh, you know, eliminating that much current flowing in every time that unit starts up, uh, certainly going to save me some, some energy, uh, over the years, not giant amounts. Cause that's only for a split second, you know, but, uh, even still, uh, that's still a lot of power. And so being able to uh, reduce that down, uh, to the point that I've been able to, uh, is really going to. Uh, help, I think. So anyway, uh, please uh, comment uh, any questions you may have and uh, like and subscribe so that uh, I can continue uh, providing helpful videos like these for you.